Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I wanted to talk about a brand called Baboon to the Moon. So I actually just recently purchased something from them and I wanted to kind of do a little unboxing, a little first impressions, um, I guess a mini review of like how I'm feeling about it. Got it from Nordstrom and first of all, this is so disrespectful. Like I hate when I get packages and they're open like that. Like was it during like transit or was somebody peeking like i'm always wondering so um got it from nordstrom and if you guys have tiktok this brand is always 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 popping up on my tiktok with ads like they really have encouraged so many people to purchase their stuff just off of the ads so like kudos to them for like marketing because it's working um so this is like the little bag that it came in like fresh out of the Nordstrom bag and this is how it looks um I purchased this green color because I was like I've always wanted like a green bag and like I've been eyeing this like coach bag but then also I'm just like you know what I love a good practical bag like I love a good practical bag and as you guys seen in my most recent bag haul mini bag haul you guys would have known that like i love me a really good like backpack crossbody bag stuff like that so um here's a little bit of details about it resist to tear scuffs and abrasion stylish durability and lightweight strength designed for living built to last um a lot of their things that is super popular is definitely like their little like luggage carry-on because you can use it as a backpack and it's also like a duffel bag so that might be another thing that i'm looking into next from this brand um like first like right off the bat i really like the compartments that it has again like i love the green i probably would have loved if like the strap was black that would have been like a really cute sporty vibe to it um but also i feel like this kind of makes it look more chic also i did want to point out that this cora dura like this right here where it says that um and it says it right here so this is actually on my supreme fanny pack so i did want to point that out because like you know if supreme uses it then it has to be good and i love the durability of my supreme fanny pack and i just never knew like behind like the material and i do like that it comes with stuff like this because it's just telling you about the material of the bag so let's go ahead and get right into like a little bit more of the details so it has their little logo right here so that is their logo and then I love these little tassels. I think that's so cute. And then it has two compartments in the front. So with the tassels, it has like the main compartment. So when you open that, oh my gosh, I wasn't ready. It's so cute. First of all, I really like this little logo right inside here. Let's see if you guys can see. It says baboon to the moon. It has a little compartment right here. And then it also has two compartments in the back. I love me a really good compartment. It also has a little key holder as well through here. So this is the main compartment and it's very spacious. I also really like this like little background. It has like a little bit of like detailing. It's kind of very light. So when you zip that main compartment up, then like right below it, like immediately right below that main compartment, you have um a second compartment so this one is just very you know easy simple big this like little small compartment was if it was going to fit my phone okay so that small compartment right underneath fits your phone which i think is perfect um so just to give you a comparison and i have an 11 iphone 11 pro max and then on the back um, there's another little zipper and this one is pretty deep. I can pretty much stick my whole hand in there. So yeah, so right now I want to go ahead and start filling this up. So I actually brought, excuse me, my purse that I'm wearing right now. First of all, this purse is so cute. It's from Target. I got it on sale, so I'm not sure if they have it anymore, but it's super pretty. It just reminds me of a, the Bottega Veneta bag. Um... So I'm going to go ahead and just take what I have in here. So I guess this is going to be a also like a little 
what's in my bag or what I've been keeping in my bag lately because I haven't done those here recently. So the main compartment, which is this top slot, I, let's see, I have like this little Bagu pouch and this is just filled up with like some cotton balls, this Afrin spray. I've been needing to carry this because um, for some time now I've had like some nosebleeds or whatnot. So I've just carried that. I also have like another kind because I had to go to the ER like, like maybe a month ago for like a really bad nosebleed. So they gave me another kind. So these are just some options if you guys deal with nosebleeds or anything like that. Also in this bag, I have some antibacterial wipes. So I just have a lot. I try to keep things like um, categorized to like what like similar product it is. So like any kind of medicinal stuff or whatever. So I'm just gonna slip that right in and that fits perfectly and the flap closes down easily not too much of a hassle there then i have my i um i was gonna say my iphone my airpods so this is in a bagu case you guys know i love bagu i actually have a whole bagu collection video up i actually probably need to do like a mini part two because i've gotten a few other bagu pieces here lately comment down below if you guys want to see that um so i just have like the little regular airpods i think these are the ones that they had before they came out with the pros so i just have those stored in here and i really like to keep these secure so i'm going to use one of like not this main back slot but this like very like far back one i'm going to slide those in there and keep that really secure <clears throat> then i have some like ibuprofen, Tylenol kind of stuff. This is in a little stasher pocket bag. I love stashers. I use them a lot for like snacks and stuff like that. And I, when they came out with this pocket size, like I had to get it, it's so cute. So I have this and I don't have it inside of that baggy pouch with like other medicine type things. Um, I just have it floating around. So I'll just put that also in the back slot here next to my AirPods. So I'm gonna see if that slides back there. And it does, fits perfectly back there and still have this like main open slot here that I can fit some stuff. So let's see, next I have my wallet. Um, I have this main little compartment here. Um, this is my wallet and um, it's by MCM. It was on sale, so I don't know if they carried this exact like colorway but um you can definitely find something similar i think they have something similar i love this wallet it has like a top compartment it has three slots on the front three slots on the back and then it has um a little compartment right here so it's really good and i love carrying card holders and this is just like one of my favorites so i'm gonna just stick that in that main compartment i could also stuck it right there but i'm gonna stick it in that main compartment um so I'm gonna stick it there. Then I have like my little lip balm. So I'm always reaching for this. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and put that in the front right here where it's like easily accessible. And I have another pouch. So this is another baggy pouch. Also these do not come separately. They come as like a set of three. So I definitely do recommend these and like the bigger size you can use for like traveling and stuff like that. Inside of this, I have like an extra hair tie. I have this like little birdie alarm um, thing. You can just like pull the top of this and like the alarm just goes off and it's just really just like for danger um, kind of situations and it's loud. Like when I first got this, I was like, Okay, like I was trying to figure out how I can shut it off. It's very, 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 very loud. And I like that this like ring here, you can stick your hand through. So if you're like running, jogging, whatever, this is just like a really good hands-free kind of thing. And also it comes with this cute little ring. So you can also use this for your keys or whatnot. So yeah, it's, it's perfect. Um, let's see. So I'm gonna put this right in like right on the side of my other bag new pouch so not in any compartment just right on the side what else so i just have some paperwork which that is like i'm not gonna pack that 
an extra mask because I do still have to wear a mask for work. So I'll just lay this like right on top. And next I have some hand sanitizer. Um, let's see, I might put that in the front. I'm gonna put that in the front pocket here and some gum and that can honestly float around as well so I'm ready to zip her up so it zipped up with no problem bottom zip zipped up with no problem and the back I can store my phone so I'm just gonna slide my phone back here this is more of a snug fit um, but it fit my phone. So I'm gonna go ahead and try this on for you guys. I'm gonna show you a few different ways that I like to carry my like bags like this. First off, it's like this, which it fits perfectly. This is so cute. A lot of my um, belt bags, they are really hard to kind of carry on the side like this, but because this is actually flat, I feel like it just sits very, very good. Like it's super cute. It just hits at like a really good, um, really good angle. So this is like already adjusted. So this is like, I guess the tightest that it comes. Like a crossbody kind of vibe here, which I like. And again, I love that it remains flat on the back because it's just easy. And then I'll show you guys the chest size. Okay. So obviously I probably wouldn't stack it to the brim like this if I'm wearing it as a chest bag because it seems like it's kind of like flopping like that. Um, so I probably wouldn't pack it so much. So perfect for hiking or just any kind of light activities. But as an everyday bag, I'll probably use it as a shoulder bag or as a crossbody bag. Just honestly like so in love with it. And I definitely love my decision on purchasing it. It is definitely worth the hype. Any kind of ad on a like social media app, you think like, okay, yeah, right. That product is probably not as good as it seems, but it is. And I'm excited that I went ahead and tried it out and I can't wait to add this to my collection. It's super cute and I definitely recommend it. So comment down below if you've tried out this brand or if you're interested in trying it out, I'll leave the link down below on where I purchased this. And um, yeah, just let me know what you guys think and comment down below if you guys wanna see more videos like this. So like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video.